Welcome to Good Mythical More. Don't Google that, whatever you do. Do not Google, does this look normal? <laughs> Don't do it. Oh, you've already done it. You're Why doing you it right do now. It? Oh, please. Oh, gosh. All uh, right. Um, oh, come on. Oh, gosh. Oh, that doesn't look normal. That doesn't look normal. That doesn't look normal. That doesn't. Why no. are you showing me a slideshow? <laughs> of, I didn't know Google Images even did that. All right, Emily, right, come on you, in here. David, how are you doing that? So we invited Emily on. Uh, she's relatively new. Uh, well, yeah. It's yeah, well, I'm Relative to uh, other people on, on the Good Mythical crew. Um, so uh, we thought this would be a good opportunity to get to know you as well as um, some southern things to determine which of the two things you're going to present mm -hmm. are more southern. More country. More country. More country. And we asked you to do this because uh, you've got the credentials, right? Yeah. Um, Where were you born? I was I was born in Arkansas, but I don't like bringing it up. But I grew up. I did. I grew up. <laughs> But I did bring it. But I, I grew up in Nashville, Tennessee, and my uh, parents are both bluegrass musicians. My really, yeah. My we father. talking banjo, mandolin. Yeah. Well, my father won a Grammy in 2016. What? Who, what? Who, who, what? How, what? You that wasn't it. on your what? resume. It is actually. I'm oh. pretty sure. <laughs> I, I think I brought it up in the interview. I bring it up wherever I can. Like it's the coolest thing about me. For what? Bluegrass oh. album of the year. Oh, what? What's yeah. the, what is his name? Well, who is he? The Steel Drivers. The Steel, steel drivers? drivers? Yeah. They're steel driving. Yeah. <laughs> all, after all these look years. Look them up. I will, I will plug my family any any time because, you know, that will steel is drivers. not building itself, huh? <laughs> 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 That's can, probably a saying in of itself. Can you, can you play a, a bluegrass instrument? I cannot. They tried very hard. They I took all kinds of lessons. It I wasn't like a family sing-along thing? Oh, well, I sang with my family okay. at nursing homes and church stuff. But okay. we didn't, I could never play an instrument. I was so bad. How'd it's you hard. go over at the nursing homes? Did great. You kill? Oh. They, they're great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, uh. God, I hope not. Uh, um, but uh, no, I think oh, that gosh. we mm. did well. We brought some life back mm. into the place. All right, present All right, Give us the us. first option. All right, so um, your first option for what is more country is Cracker Barrel versus Waffle House. Cracker Barrel. Crack, uh... Without, with, without. Yeah, Waffle House is, is not just in the South. Uh, well, neither is Cracker Barrel anymore, but, but Cracker the Barrel, they the, serve. the whole yes. environment is uh, is like Southern down home cooking where There's Waffle House is more outside. just great breakfast food that mm -hmm. does happen to have like a. They have patty melts though. They yeah, have... I mean, it's it's got some Southern influence. Oh, sure. Definitely, but mm -hmm. the Cracker Barrel, I mean, that's as Southern as a chain restaurant. Are we be. right? I, I would think so. That's no, don't. That no, would, you're the authority right now. Yes, so if I people want to hate on anything that we say, <laughs> they're going to direct it towards you. That's fine. You Emily. Can bring on the hate. But, uh, Does I, your family call you Emily? They, Do em, they shorten Emmy, it? Emmy. 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 That's exactly, Emmy. That's exactly right. Emmy. Emmy. No, but Cracker Barrel has the rocking chairs out front. Oh, yeah. They sell Beanie Babies. I don't know why that's... That's like, pretty, I think that's pretty, pretty country. country. All right, give us another one. All right, so next is Cornbread versus Biscuits. Oh, okay. Well, this is tough because I've mm -hmm. been to some some uh, um, some deep, deep south mm. areas and you get a good... You think you want to say biscuit, but that cornbread... Well, and incidentally, at, at Cracker Barrel, they bring you an even amount of both unless you ask. They bring you so cornbread now, and biscuits. So now Cracker Barrel, their decision is the standard. Well, no, whenever it, we can. It, well, exactly. <laughs> I mean, if 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 uh, Cracker Barrel is like the arbiter of what is more southern, they are saying that these are equal now, equally country. And the most country cornbread is the ones that it's fried in a pan, and it like it gets real flat, and you can you can fry it really hard, and it mm -hmm. gets really crunchy. You know what I'm talking about? It's dry, like the kind that we had in Pembroke when we were making the documentary. And they would call it fry bread, and they would have collard sandwiches, oh. and it would be collards with um, fry bread, or uh, it was basically cornbread sa sandwich, very greasy. Very yes. awesome. Yeah. So we're saying cornbread. We're saying I think cornbread too, but really, I was gonna I, say, I was gonna say that they were equal, but not but the I'm, loafy. I'm not talking about the loafy in a pan. You know, like biscuits. slice it like a cake cornbread. Oh. I, I think that's equal to biscuits in terms of southern. But when well, you I get that like we're fried kind of, in a, I think in we're a getting skillet, too te technical. Well, here's one point. more question for you guys: What's your opinion? Sweet cornbread or dry cornbread? Sweet. I love sweet. I a like little sweet undercooked. Too. Yeah, mm. I like it with Mushy. corn in it. Ooh, there you go. There's pieces of corn in yeah, it. Just like your dookie. 
<laughs> next one. Just like All right. your dookie. So next one is white gravy versus brown gravy. Ooh. I've never seen any, I've tough. never seen, I mean white gravy, because I've never seen it looks like white ranch. gravy <laughs> anywhere else. Like white, like gr biscuits and gravy, again, biscuits and gravy, it's not cornbread and gravy. But mm -hmm. um, mm. they put brown gravy on things everywhere. Mm -hmm. I mean, you, that's- But if you, you get, get country Midwest. fried steak here in LA, it's gonna have white gravy on it. Well, yeah, because they got it from the South. And it has the word country in it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, it's white gravy. It's more country, yeah. White gravy. You agree with that? Yeah. I agree, 100%. Anything that looks like ranch dressing, okay. I think is gonna be country. Right. All right, what about the people from Arkansas? You need to backtrack a little bit. They're they... fine with whatever I'm doing <laughs> right now. I think they're just happy to see someone is on television. For <laughs> Other than the girl from The Bachelor. She's, <laughs> shout out. Uh, uh, girl, uh, girl, this ain't television. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it is. It's the new TV. Oh God! Okay. It's the new TV. Up next is Levi's versus Wrangler. Uh, right. Wrangler. Wrangler is a is like a cowboy thing. Yeah. Which, it, it like, it it has it has like a Mustang on their logo. So just because it's cowboy, I mean that's not. Well, I'm thinking Southern. <laughs> cowboy is not Southern. Cowboy is. Uh, it's, I guess it's still country. Wherever it's cows country. are. Texas is country. And boys. It's definitely uh, Wrangler. We, remember, we went through a phase, a very short phase. Yep. I think there's evidence of this in the Book of Mythicality. Yeah. I don't know, I decided to put that picture in there. I probably shouldn't have. Uh, but there was like a two week phase where we got like cowboy shirts, cowboy hats, uh, roper boots. We, they were cowboy boots, but they were ropers, which they, they had the laces on them. Yeah. Mm. And then Wrangler jeans, and we went to the state fair together nice. because we heard there was some girls that l liked some guys at school that had that look, and we were like, well, they can like us too. <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, I looked in the mirror one day, I was like, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care how much the ladies like this. Yeah, I agree that Wrangler and is I burned it all. the more southern one. Um, all right. So next is more country. You mean? More country, my bad. Yeah. It, it's a little different, country and southern. Yeah, yeah I think so too. Because it can be more, it can be broader. Broader, yep. All right, so the next one is fried chicken versus barbecue chicken. Mm. Well, if it was fried chicken versus barbecue, but barbecue chicken. It would definitely be barbecue. Uh, that mm. really, that, that throws a wrench in it. I mean, if <laughs> every Sunday for lunch, you gotta have that fried chicken. I think fried church. chicken. Yeah. I think because it's fried. I mean, I think yeah. it, it it takes the cake because it's got fried the word fried in it. Yeah, I so agree with I'm, that. I'm I agree. I think chicken. anything that um, whichever one is most likely to burn down your trailer is the more country one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So a deep fryer is more likely to do it than a grill. <laughs> right. You don't even have to go outside. So for it. no offense. To, I love trailers. <laughs> no offense to trailers. Just don't burn it down. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I don't, that's you know, the only bad. Hitch thing. it up and move it if yeah. the fire is coming. <laughs> Yeah, well, add the, wind to well, it. Well, the wind will that'll, that'll cause it help. to completely inflame. <laughs> <laughs> I've done that. <laughs> Sounds like a movie scene from like Smokey and the Bandit. All right, this one's gonna be real tough. Um, it's Merle Haggard versus Taylor Swift. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> you're baiting oh, us. Okay. Although she, Merle was born in Bakersfield, California, and uh, lived his entire life in California. Um, I think you but again, it's not southern. It's country. country. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. 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 I, I'm he's just a saying. country music. Taylor Swift legend. was born in Pennsylvania. Oh yeah. The answer so. is clearly Merle Haggard, without a doubt. Yeah. Just, yeah. A lot of people are like, Do you want to make an from? argument? No. Good. I don't. Not. No offense. Want to keep working I like here. Taylor Swift, but I mean, I just don't. She's she's given up that country life. I think. Well, she's. It's still in there. I still believe in yeah. you, Tay Tay. Come back to us. It's still in there, but I think she's, she's got. She can move down. She can make a country album she again. Can do whatever she wants. That's what I've always said about it. All right. Next. Okay. Merle can't because he passed away. That's right. All right. This next in. one is big ass belt buckles versus suspenders. <laughs> belt buckles. Suspenders. <laughs> <laughs> what? Suspenders? You know, like in, in To Kill a Mockingbird, all the all the the that's a the southern, lawyers. That's have not the, country. That's southern a, lawyer. That's a southern gentleman. That's, southern yeah, lawyer. Yeah. So it's not country, I guess. Yeah. Suspenders in a bow tie. Now, um, Uncle Glenn wears suspenders everywhere. You don't know. You never met Uncle Glenn. No, you just say, name I know, seems he's foreign great. to me. Um, my in-laws' friends, uh, Glenn and Carolyn, they always come over to the house That's whenever we're visiting, and they call him Uncle Glenn. Okay. And he and he has a big belly, and he has suspenders. And the suspenders, when they get to the belly, they go out and then <laughs> yeah. around them. Yeah, right. <laughs> and he's the sweetest guy. They frame the belly. But he's not country. 
He is, is very, he, is very he, Is he a lawyer? <laughs> he, he delivered auto parts for years yeah. in a truck that looked like Jeff Gordon's race car. That's so he's, pretty country. He's pretty, <laughs> yeah. he's pretty country. Yeah, yeah. But I think a big ass belt buckle. Yeah, that's, that's gonna have to be. Kick. I think this might yeah. be. Let's see. Oh, this is. I think the last one. Yard couch versus above ground pool. Oh. <laughs> now above ground pools have gotten pretty fancy. There's a lot of people that try to get away with the above ground pool and like pass it off as like a nice accoutrement to yeah, the house. Yeah, I'm gonna add something to this and say these are both in the front yard. Oh, okay. <laughs> Which is more country. Now, does the above ground mm. pool have one of those uh, decks around it that makes uh -uh. it seem just like a Just a little, you can... oh, just a little, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, can... just a little stupid ladder just like, going so, up yeah. there. Stupid ladder. Like if yeah. Uncle Glenn like gets too close to it and leans on it, the whole thing, thing empties. falls down. It's an yeah. America's Funniest Home Video. Yeah. Oh, yeah, episode. so you're talking about the one that my wife grew up swimming in. <laughs> oh, sorry. No, okay. she had one that just was yes. just right out there in the yard? Yep. And uh, <laughs> when we fill were, it up it, with a hose. It that's you it. Cool. She's pretty country. When too. we were, yeah, <laughs> when we were dating, it was. It's not there now. But when we were dating, uh, we go swimming that thing. Those are great pools. And you know what? When I jumped in, you know what happened? I found myself sitting on the couch. <laughs> in the pool. In the pool. <laughs> They're real country. That's really cool. no. But uh, I, the actually, couch in the front the, yard the couch, is more country. The couch. If you're not selling it. It's like, you getting rid of that couch? No, no I'm just, this is where it is. Couch. People, every time somebody tries to take it, like they think it's on Craigslist, he'd come out with a shotgun. <laughs> Get off my couch! <laughs> yeah, that's more country. All right, all right. So, so we got them all correct. Yeah, I, I would think so. Yeah, Good. I don't know if that was the object, but. Uh, no, we, no, I think that's all opinion. It's all what you believe. And we apologize to the Arkansonians, is that what you say? Arkansans. She's, Ar she's not. Yeah, I apologize to I'm not apologizing. They're she's fine. Not fine. They're fine. Yeah, they're going to do it. They're doing great. You're they're doing, doing great. great. You're doing great. What's your Twitter handle? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, at Flimily Emming. <laughs>